Hello, and thanks for stopping by this Adobe Spark page, which is going to be the backup resource for training that I'm doing on Adobe Premiere Rush. You might be wondering how a professor in sexualities and genders, health and well-being, actually gets into doing all this um, university-wide training on Adobe Spark and Adobe Rush. Well, it stems back to 2014, when I became a National Teaching Fellow. With that award, I wanted to focus on sharing learning outside the classroom. So I'd originally intended to try to explore how to take um, uh, learning out of the academy and share it via uh, documentaries. Now, it hasn't worked out like that, but I have been able to do so many of these different training sessions, enabling each and every one of you to take your learning outside of the classroom. Also, there have been some documentary opportunities uh, because I've now written a few uh, blogs, various WordPress pages. They've been spotted by different television companies. And in these last couple of years alone, I've been interviewed with Rupert Everett uh, on a program called The Fifty Shades of Gay. And that was looking at 50 years since the first partial decriminalization of male homosexuality in the UK back in 1967. And uh, most recently, two different documentaries, uh, one for CNN and one that I'm not allowed to mention yet because it won't be out until next year. Um, those two documentaries focusing on the life of Her Late Royal Highness uh, Princess Diana, the Princess of Wales, and especially in the way in which she broke down HIV stigmas. So just by writing blog pages, um, those were just uh, um, discovered by different TV filmmaking uh, companies and they then contacted me to appear in their documentaries. So come on, let's start making some videos and share learning outside the classroom here. Very much from the point of view of you sharing your learning, when you're in the classrooms, obviously you've got your time in which you're standing there in front of the students sharing learning with them. E-learning is very different and if you check out one of the other pages I've made as part of this series, you'll see the, um, the various recommendations I'm making that we need to change our mind uh, set on this from being classroom teachers to online learning teachers. So how are we meant to do that? And using videos and making videos is just going to be one way. So even if you want to prepare a, um, a formal lecture session, rather than maybe do the whole thing and just upload that in one big chunk, you might want to break it up into separate chunks or smaller chunks that you can then embed within your Moodle or on a Spark page or something similar. So using Adobe Rush will teach you exactly how to do that, how to use uh, um, little bits of video, how to add in other bits. Uh, you, you'll hear about things like B-roll and using your introduction, uh, introductory screens, transitions. We can do all of that in our session that's planned for us through GLT. Okay, so I look forward to seeing you online. It will be a really fun and interactive session. You will go away with having done something by the time you finished it. But when you scroll down this um, uh, main Spark page, you'll see that you do need to sign in to your university Adobe Creative Cloud suite first. You need to download Adobe Premiere Rush and have it on whichever machine you're going to be using during the training session. You are allowed to download it onto multiple devices. It could be um, um, a desktop, laptop, iPad, telephone, whichever you prefer using. Okay, so for the training event, you will need to be sitting in front of some sort of device, uh, whatever it is, and you must have Adobe Rush uploaded onto there. Okay, uh, so have fun. I hope you enjoy the rest of this resource. See you soon. Bye.